Using translucent solid fills, you can create a new fill type with any translucence value you wish. Activate 05-02, the next preset view. In this phase, we will show how the translucent fill works. For demonstration purposes, we will use a simple office building elevation. Zoom in to the left side of the elevation and select the solid fill on the glass surface. Make sure the suspend group is inactive. In this case, all fill pieces will be selected as one. This solid fill group represents the glass surface of the building. Change the selected fill type to 70%, then 33%, and finally set it to 10%. As you can see, the glass surface has turned translucent in correlation to the percentage value. The contours of the people and equipment are now visible inside the building. Let's create a new translucent fill and see how it works. Open the Fill Types Attribute palette and click on the New button. Then choose the solid fill type and enter Shadow Fill for the name and then press OK. Check the Cover Fills option as well on the dialog and enter 60% for translucency. If you select other intensities, the preview in the pattern will be automatically modified. Let's accept the 60% translucency now and press OK. Select the black solid fill group which represents the shadow of the elevation. This fill, which covers the rest of the elevation, is a normal solid fill because it doesn't have any translucence. Change this fill type to the newly created shadow fill with the 60% translucence. Zoom in to the shadow area. The new translucent fills just partly cover the elevation, so this type provides a clear visibility for the metal panels, the glass surfaces, and the entire elevation. Image and translucent fills allow architects to remain in the ARCHICAD environment when preparing documents for competitions and client presentations. The ability to produce high-quality presentation drawings is a huge competitive advantage for ARCHICAD users.